Hello everyone, welcome to Chanakya IAS Academy's Current Affairs MCQs. Let's see today's questions. Question number one. Consider the following statements regarding cryptocurrency. One, cryptocurrency is a centralized currency controlled by the Reserve Bank of India. Two, transactions with cryptocurrency are recorded on a public digital ledger called blockchain. Which of these statements given above is or are correct? The options are A, one only, B, two only, C, both one and two, and D, neither one nor two. The correct answer is option B, two only. Recently, the finance ministers and central bank governors from G20 nations adopted a roadmap for regulating crypto assets proposed by the Financial Stability Board and the International Monetary Fund at their meeting at Marrakesh in Morocco. A cryptocurrency is a digital or virtual currency that uses cryptography for security. For example, Bitcoin, Ethereum and Litecoin. Statement 1 is not correct. It is a decentralized currency, meaning it is not controlled by any government or institution. The decentralized system of cryptocurrency makes it faster and cheaper to transfer money. Statement 2 is correct. Transactions with cryptocurrency are recorded on a public digital ledger called blockchain. By using cryptocurrency, it gets easier to transfer money without any involvement of banks or other financial institutions. Question number 2. Consider the following countries. 1. Laos, Brunei, Thailand, Vietnam, Papua New Guinea and Philippines. How many of the above countries are members of ASEAN grouping? The options are A only 3, B only 4, C only 5 and D all 6. The correct answer is C only 5. Higher oil prices can be mitigated in the member countries of the Association of Southeast Asian Nations countries if an agreement comes up with the Gulf Cooperation Council. The ASEAN was established on 8th August 1967 in Bangkok, Thailand with the signing of the ASEAN Declaration. The 10 member state of ASEAN are Brunei, Cambodia, Indonesia, Laos, Malaysia, Myanmar, Philippines, Singapore, Thailand and Vietnam. Question number 3. Dhanori wetland sometimes seen in news is located in which of the following state or UT? The options are A. Karnataka, B. Jammu and Kashmir, C. Tamil Nadu and D. Uttar Pradesh. The correct answer is D. Uttar Pradesh. Dhanori wetland is to be notified as Balmiki Ramsar wetland and Saras sanctuary or conservation reserve whose proposal is pending before the Uttar Pradesh Wetland Authority. The location is Greater Noida, Uttar Pradesh. Area covered is 98 hectares. Importance, it is home to over 217 species of birds including Saras crane. It is possibly the largest roosting site for Saras cranes in North India. It recharges groundwater and helps the community sustain its agricultural practices in the region. Let's talk about the recognition. It has been recognized as an important bird area by BirdLife International and so recorded by the BNHS, Bombay Natural History Society. Question number four. Which city is the host of World Health Summit 2023? The options are A. New Delhi, B. Berlin, C. Rome and D. New York. The correct answer is B. Berlin. The World Health Summit, a global health conference and network, gathers participants from various sectors including politics, science, the private sector and civil society worldwide to shape the course for a healthier future by fostering innovative solutions for improved health and well-being for everyone. This year, the event is scheduled to occur in Berlin, Germany and online focusing on the theme, a defining year for global health action. Question number 5. Some Preeti 11 military exercises held between India and which country? The options are A. Sri Lanka, B. Bangladesh, C. France and D. Iran. 
the correct answer is b bangladesh the 11th edition of the bilateral military exercise sampriti 11 between india and bangladesh has concluded the exercise began at the joint training node umroi in meghalaya this exercise alternatingly organized by both countries signifies strong bilateral defense cooperation initiatives we conclude today's session here tomorrow we will meet with few more mcqs till then please like share and subscribe our channel thank you don't forget to like share and subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update